Yo, sapas. Um, uh, quickly, I, uh, you know, I I wanted to show off this shirt. Uh, this is my acid bath shirt. This shirt's probably it's coming to about twelve or thirteen years old. It's one of my oldest shirts, and it's one of my favorite bands. If if I was gonna do my channel again, or if I could have another channel, I would definitely do a music channel and talk about music. But any amount of, you know, I would want to put a little bit of the music into the video, but you can't because of copyright. So that's a no for me. But anyways, uh, today's video was supposed to be focused on two things. So I was going to fo I was sent two things by the Fry Foundation. This is a Fry Foundation sponsorship video. And he sent me a satellite miner and an ETC POW node. And um, the video was supposed to be focused on that, but I would like to move this video into a different direction and talk about something else. But those, those two things are a, a part of it. So yeah, let's uh, jump right into it and I will tell you what I want to tell you. Okay, so there's a reason why I am just filming the computer screen with my camera versus OBS. But this video was supposed to be focused on this node and this GPS satellite miner and how you're able to combine them together and, you know, make a little bit more profit. Now, this ETC uh, POW node, do not buy it. It is garbage. Um, the software glitched on me. I had to reinstall it and I lost all the ETC POW that I mined. And if you look up here, uh, that claim ETC POW, POW box has never ever turned green. So I do, don't even know how to get my ETC POW out. But what I wanted to talk to about in this video is uh, how good D-pin mining is. But D-pin mining is data mining. And uh, data mining is very, very low energy cost. Um, it doesn't cost, it doesn't cost much for the items to mine and it doesn't cost you much in electricity at all. So this whole stack here, this whole stack, plus that behind that curtain, there's a weather miner. And then in, in the other room, there is a, a, a camera miner. Um, if I was to purchase all these miners um, on my own, it would cost a fraction of what I paid for my Varus farm. In paperclip fashion, I forgot to add that you can add these miners to other miners. Like, so you can take that satellite miner and you can add it to, I don't know, if you're mining on a Windows machine, you can add it and it doesn't take up much power. So yeah, I just want to quickly add that in. Um, with the Fry Foundation, every morning I wake up with $18 American. He pays out on time, every time. And yeah, I make $18 American off of like literally a fraction of, you know, what I pay for my for my Varus farm. Here, I'll show you an example. Let's just take this for example. So, these are two 5950Xs. Uh, each one of these CPUs cost me um, 500 Canadian. And then you got the motherboard, that's like 160. And then you got the RAM, which is, uh, I forget how much RAM costs. But then you got your, you know, your USB stick and your TP link. And then, oh, you got your power supply. And like, 
And guess what? One of these miners only makes me about 60 cents a day in Varus. And like, it cost me so much money when this single little GPS device that I added to this node makes me more money. And that could just be because of the price of fry than this whole setup. And like, I don't know, it's just, I think D pin is the way to freaking go. And yeah, I'm, I'm super stoked on it. And like, if you wanted to combine that GPS miner with like a better node, um, I would head over to Crypto Jar's channel. He's pretty much like the king of nodes and like he can probably point you to a better direction. Um, this node literally cost me $300 and it sucks and it makes me absolutely nothing. Maybe ETC pal will go up one day, but I don't know. But no, uh, yeah, check out Crypto Jar's channel. He, uh, he is the king of the node. So yeah, I think like the whole point of this video is to show that like there is a way cheaper way to mine. And like, uh, I think some of like Fry's miners go for pretty cheap and he pays out pretty well. So the ROI is very, very, very quick. And uh, yeah, I'll go on more. Like, um, this is probably what I'm gonna do in the future but I'm probably going to install windows onto those, onto those, um, computers. And I'm probably going to attach, uh, a fry miner to it. Uh, I'll talk to fry and talk about like the lowest, you know, the one that will take the lowest amount of, uh, CPU power. But yeah, like if, if you don't think you can afford to mine, then don't. Like I'm, I get a little bit annoyed because people like uh, Red Panda and Rabbit Mining are pushing GPU mining really, really, really hard. And like, I just bought six um, 5700 XTs and I turned my miner off because um, my projected power bill was 540 Canadian and uh, I'm already paying uh, 300 Canadian for my power bill, which is what well, well, which was already absurd for me because like I don't make that much money in real life and like I live in Vancouver. It's one of the most expensive places to live in the world. So like I don't know. I, I, D pin is king. That is the whole point of this video. D pin is king. I'm already in talks with EnviroBlock and yeah, I'm gonna probably do a partnership with them in the future and like start supporting them and with what they're doing. They're, they're doing a very similar th thing with Fry. They worked with Fry with the, the Pebble Miner. In paperclip fashion, I need to add one more thing. Um, I have my dis uh, discount code for the Fry Foundation and uh, that discount code is paperclip. But honestly, I have one of the worst discount codes out of any of the people that support <laughs> or are sponsored by Fry. Go use Tech Hustler's um, uh, discount code. I think he gets like 35% off and like my channel is all about making you guys money. So like, <laughs> I would rather, you know, you save 35% than save 10%. So yeah, um, but if you wanna support me as a creator, you can use my code and it's paperclip. So yeah, um, I just wanted to show you guys, like there's a way if you have a high energy, um, you know, kilowatt hour price, there's a cheaper way to mine. And like, and like I said, like every morning I wake up to $18 American 
and my whole Varus farm maybe may, makes me anywhere from four to twelve uh, American a day because I'm because I'm on a mid range pool, so it goes up and down. But anyways, that that's what all that's what I wanted to talk about. Um, uh, all my referral links are down below. It helps grow this channel. Um, all the links to my social media are down below. And I always forget to say this one, but there, the link to my second channel is below. I talk a little bit more about serious sides. Uh, I have an addiction and it more focuses on that. And the link to my Discord is down below. There's a lot of great people there, and if you have any questions, uh, they're usually pretty nice, and they will help you out if you are new. So yeah, uh, thanks for watching the video. Like and subscribe, and I will check you later.